panellists, thank you for joining us today on International Women's Day. We're so excited that you're with us and part of Team QCT, making the world a, a fairer place together. Thank you. Um, without any further ado, I'd like to hand over to our panel chair, Anne McElvoy, the perfect person to chair what will be the most energising and exciting panel discussion for International Women's Day and a QCT event. So it's an opportunity to relax, have fun and learn. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Thank you. Issued as a rather cool Barbie. <laughs> Not dressed in sugary pink. I think we're all people. <laughs> next, next to, uh, to Adwa, who will not be known as Barbie for the rest of this session, is Her Royal Highness the Duchess of Sussex, who started her feminist journey at the age of 11, complaining about the portrayal of women in advertising. In her present role, she's been a vociferous spokeswoman, a royal not afraid to embrace full-on feminism, and, as of today, Vice President of the QCT. Good morning, Royal Highness. Uh, uh, just a, a quick one as we're among uh, friends. I mean, how's that bump treating you? <laughs> <laughs> Very well. It's funny. I've actually been joking in the past few weeks. I'd seen this documentary on Netflix about feminism, and one of the things they said during pregnancy was, I feel the embryonic kicking of feminism. <laughs> <laughs> I love that. So boy or girl, whatever it is, we hope that that's the case with our little The bump. next generation of feminism is yeah. already on the way there. Guaranteed. You heard it here first. Royal Highness, self-care, as I now call not care, treating myself. Treating You're still treating yourself to some rather fabulous shoes. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> um, I think well, the, the treat in and of itself is being able to be here and be with these incredible women on the panel. I mean, that is such a gift on this day. And then separate from that, the women in my life um, that I want to celebrate, I will continue to send some love to today. But also the men, uh, you know, who are championing all of us as part of this journey is great. And then I'll put my feet up because that's a deserved <laughs> treat, especially at this stage of pregnancy. <laughs> Thank you so much, right? Well, it's International Women's Day and uh, having a panel like this under the auspices of the Queen's Commonwealth Trust is, uh, is, is, is really ripe for discussion, uh, especially he headed up, up by the, the Duchess herself, who is the most articulate and intelligent and kind of passionate young woman, young woman to me, but she's a young woman who is, you know, really uh, committed to the rights of girls and women around the globe.